Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. Now today is a very interesting video for me because as you know, when I speak to new brands and it's a product that I've not used before, if it's possible, it's great to work with them and create a little video where I can demo the product as I'm discovering it with you. So Nourish London have very kindly provided me with a selection in order for me to actually do an at-home facial and chat through the products feel the textures and see the results as we go. So that's exactly what I've done today. I've got our model and what I thought I would do that's a little bit different is instead of doing the salon facial where we use the cotton wool and we use the sponges and then we dab the skin dry with the tissues then we move on, I thought we would actually strip it back and do the salon style facial elements but prove that you don't need all of that. You can actually just do a facial with a high quality brand and all you need is water, a towel, face cloth, that's it. So that's exactly what we've done today and I'm gonna talk you through it. And what I think is very interesting about Nourish London is they're ethical, they're vegan friendly, they're merging science with probiotic knowledge. It's a very interesting brand to work with because it's bringing the best of both worlds together. And that's where we are at at the moment. It's very exciting in skincare that now you know that you can get your organic, your vegan friendly, your cruelty free. And what you don't need to worry about is that you're losing one thing to gain another. So let's have a look at how this works. And thank you again to Nourish London for providing these for me so that I can try this out for myself. And if you want to know anything about the brand, the links will be in the description box. And I believe that the range was created by Dr. Pauline Hilly. So I'm sure that even if you Google her name or pop her name into YouTube, you'll be able to find out lots more about the brand. So let's get started. So we're starting our Nourish London facial with the Kale 3D Cleanse. And what we're going to do on our model today is show that you don't have to use all of the equipment that normally goes with a salon facial. So when you're doing this yourself, you dampen the skin so you can splash your face if you'd prefer to. And in the salon, we just use some water just to dampen the skin ourselves. Two or three pumps of the product and then just start to apply this to the skin and make sure you take it down to the base of the neck to get the full value of your product because you don't want to really treat your face to all the powerful ingredients and then leave out the neck. So again, all we're going to do today is prove that you can use all of the Nourish London products yourself and all you really need is the product, some water and a face cloth and a towel and that's everything that you need. Now the great thing about this product is that there's a colour change when you're using it so that you know that you've activated it and it changes from the white colour to a subtle shade of green. So this can help guide you when you're doing your deep cleanse and when you've got your colour activation then you know that the product is working and you are ensured that you're activating the full potential. And with this face wash you're helping to lift the impurities in the skin and with the boost in circulation you are going to see radiance and it contains hyaluronic acid, probiotics, kale. These all help to detoxify. So if you're working in a particularly polluted environment, in city centres, using a product like this as your facial wash is really going to help make sure that any makeup, any dirt, any surface grime is thoroughly removed. So once you've worked over the skin and you can see that it's changed colour, if you're using it on yourself, just rinse it off with cool water. But again, just to show you that we don't need sponges and cotton wool pads and tissues, 
I'm just using a damp face cloth here and just working over the skin very gently but firmly just to remove the product. And again, because you're stimulating the skin, there might be a bit of redness there, a bit of erythema. And it's worth remembering that if you are really looking to invest in high quality organic products, then this particular facial wash is coming in at 70% organic. And it's also made in the UK. So once you've removed it from the skin, again, you're just patting it dry. And it's as simple as that. Just pat the skin dry. And it's not a drying mask. It's not a tightening mask. The skin feels very moisturised. Because again, even though it looks mask-like, it's actually a facial wash. It's very clever in that way. So first time using this kind of facial wash and I thought it was very clever. I liked the formulation and the key was it was extremely easy to remove. So next we're going to try out the Probiotic Multi-Mineral Repair Mask. So the packaging means that you just pump out what you need. I'd suggest two or three pumps just to get you started. Again, take it down to the base of the neck. The packaging demonstrates that there must be some powerful potent ingredients in there because it's not able to oxidise. You can't open a lid and lose the potency of the product. So straight away you know that you've got something special there. And the recommendations are that on clean dry skin, which is what we've got here, you apply a generous amount and you take a little bit of time to massage it in and it will start to absorb where it's needed. Then you just relax for five minutes and the mineral complex will get to work. So we've just taken our time to cover the face and again give it just a little bit of effleurage, some circles and you can already see here it's starting to sink in to the cheeks and it's starting to sink in to the forehead. So you know that's thirsty skin. And it is um, in the summer you do get, well, you can get drier skin than normal because of the heat that's within the air. And five minutes later, the mask has really significantly absorbed into the skin. And your options are to wear the, uh, the mask overnight if you want it to become an intensive repair mask or you can wipe away excess which is what we're doing here. If your preference is to rinse away the excess with warm water you can do that too but because of the quality of the ingredients in the mask just wiping away the excess and allowing it to sink in can be extra beneficial to your skin. And the infusion of the damask rose and the lavender with the probiotic minerals means again that you're treating the skin and you're really helping to plump it up. And if there was any dehydration causing some surface fine lines and wrinkles, then by plumping it up and really incorporating those key ingredients in, you're going to significantly improve the appearance. And this particular product is coming in at 81% organic. Again, nice, silky product to use and, and so easy to apply and remove, which is always a key. If something's too difficult to remove or too messy to apply, sometimes that's the difference between wanting to use it again or sometimes it ends up just staying in a cabinet. So this one, extremely easy to use. Then we move on to our Radiance Firming Facial Oil. It's got the dropper, which means you've got ease of control for the product. And I'd always suggest going in maybe with less droplets than you think you need just to get you started. So maybe four to six might be enough. And what you can do 
is add to it if you need to rather than saturate the skin with too much product because that would make it harder to work with but it's also a waste of your product so start with about four to six drops and add if you need to and with this facial oil again it's part of the anti-aging group it's filled with omegas these are all helping to hydrate the skin help to plump it out you've got french marine algae extract which is helping to slow down your breakdown of collagen and elastin you've got your pumpkin seed oil to improve the skin tone and you've also got your macadamia nut oil to help again to counter those fine lines but a lot of what's achievable with these products is how you apply them so by taking your time to do a nice facial massage with it and if you can standing in front of the mirror and doing some of your facial toning some of your facial yoga moves you're really going to maximize the effects of the product because you're taking the time to allow those active ingredients to sink in and get to work When you perform your massage, you get the benefits externally, but you also allow the benefits to begin internally. And when you mix this product in with the full routine, the results start to become more noticeable. And you only need to use your facial oil if you want. And you can use it every night if you wish, or you could save it for a twice weekly treat, or you could pop a little bit on every day, but then once or twice a week, just take the time to actually give yourself a five, ten minute facial massage with it. And the inhalation will also help to benefit you to benefit your mood, which again triggers so much more in you than just popping on a product slapping it on and not giving it a second thought if you're going to invest in high quality products then it's always good just to take a few moments to maximize exactly how it can work for you and the facial oil comes in at 98 percent organic again when you're doing your facial massage Not only can you do lovely stretching effleurage moves, but you can stretch out at the lips, at the nose, the forehead and the eyebrows, all the areas where we can carry lots of tension. And by working on the jawline and the neck, we can help to tone that muscle too. Remember, All of those muscles and tissues in the face will respond to toning just in the same way that your body's muscles and tissues respond to toning too. So you don't always have to feel that invasive treatments are the way. Sometimes it's as simple as using a high quality product and working with those muscles to get those results. And again, using the facial oil is a great way to encourage you to get into the habit of doing your drainage movements. So if you do get those puffy cheeks or you do get the puffy eyes, then do your pressures and drain to those lymph nodes. And using a product which is designed to work with you in achieving that will maximise your results. And you can see here just around six or so drops of the oil and we're able to do quite an in-depth facial massage. So we didn't have to use a large amount, it was just a few droplets. So that lets you know that a little really does go a long way.
and we can just stretch every area of skin, make sure that we've covered everything with product. And then if you've got some left over and you want to, then you could always work into the hairline and into the scalp too. When we're using this on a model, the key we're looking for here is deep relaxation. When you're working on yourself, you can do the deep relaxation moves, but you could also finish with some stimulating moves. And again, if you want to do your stimulating moves, then you can research facial exercises, facial yoga and there are lots of moves that you can use the oil to help you with but instead of deep relaxation it's rejuvenation as in the massage is designed specifically for toning specifically for stimulation and not on the relaxation side because you still will tone and relax whilst you're doing this style of massage but we are soothing the nerve endings but conversely you can choose to stimulate the nerve endings and again just to prove how little you need we are actually doing just a little bit of facial massage into the hair into the scalp Starting to use some Indian head massage style movements, some pressures, and just making full use of the product. When you're working into the hair, the added benefits are all of those nerve endings within the scalp. You can really trigger additional relaxation, which in turn helps to improve the appearance because if you are tense in any way, you start to relax. If you don't realise you've got a furrowed brow and you're scowling, then just through working on the scalp can really help you to relax. A lot of people get tingles when you work on the scalp too. And even though the product's not specifically designed for the hair and designed for the scalp, because it's a high quality organic product, it's not going to do anything other than benefit the hair and benefit the scalp. So just the residual tiny amounts of oil that are still on the hands just work through not to the point as you can see where the hair is greasy the hair is not greasy in the slightest but it doesn't do any harm at all and then just very delicately turning the head to the side and just doing little delicate massages little finger circles sometimes we call them finger frictions, again, they all connect into each other. So the neck starts to relax, the shoulders start to relax, the face starts to relax. Sometimes with a client, you might see a, lit a little delicate smile on their face and it might not be a conscious smile, it can just be the, the relaxation that's occurring as you allow them to gently switch off. Because even if they're enjoying the treatment, sometimes their mind is ticking away and they're thinking about things. 
And you tend to see as a therapist when that has finished and they actually have stopped thinking about tasks and to-do lists and what they're going to make for dinner. And you can actually see that happen within the client. So once we've used our facial oil, we can move on to the kale anti-aging eye cream. It's again an easy to use pump and don't use too much. I would say no more than a very small pea-sized amount. And what you're going to do is use the ring finger because it's got the least pressure and very gently pat around the eyes. Now I like to work from the inside out, top and bottom, and just gently pat out around the occipital bone and then very gently pat above the eye when there's only a residual amount of product, just over the free lid, not too close to the lashes. And that's my preference. And this particular product sinks in very easily. And it's got your amino acids, your B vitamins and your antioxidants. Again, all working towards minimising those fine lines. Again, it's got your kale extract. And then finally, we finish off with our Argan Skin Renew Moisturiser. Now, with your moisturiser, because we've used enough products that you would use in a salon facial, you don't want your moisturiser to be heavy. So this particular moisturiser is nice and light. And all you're doing is applying your small amount to the face and neck. And then you're just performing a very light facial massage. I'd say stroking movements just to allow it to absorb. And this is again working towards your anti-aging routine. It's got more of your omega rich products this time. It's got your argan oil in it. It's got vitamin E. It's got myrrh. It's got rose of Jericho. Lots of ingredients that smell lovely but are also again working towards cellular repair and reducing the appearance of those fine lines. And again, we're not claiming that we use products and you have blemish-free, line-free perfection. What we're saying is you use carefully targeted products, you look after yourself, you enjoy life and everything working together makes you look and feel the best that you can. And by taking your time just to pop the product on properly and not just slap it on or rub it on very vigorously, by taking the time to apply it nicely and effectively, you're going to get the best results. And your moisturiser comes in at 85% organic. So I like to finish off in the salon, just massage the temples. It can be nice also to cover the ears. But this is our little demo of Nourish London and I really enjoyed using the products. I think they're great. They're very easy to use. They feel very luxurious but very light. And if you've used Nourish London or would like to try it, then leave me a comment.